I think I'm probably gonna get like a Telolite on my first one. Watch. The Telolite Mythic, I'm probably gonna get that. And so 9 hours and 11 minutes, let's go ahead and speed this up. I told you. Watch, the second one will be Sir Valgar. You ready? Sir Valgar it is. <laughs> no way. Hey guys and I guys, welcome back to Email Monster Video. So in today's video, we're going to be checking out this new quest monster, Helium. So we're going to go ahead and try to breed it, and hopefully we can get it in the first few tries. So I hope you guys are excited. If you are, make sure you drop a like, subscribe. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. Also guys, just letting you guys know, it's last lap, so make sure you complete the laps with your team. So, meet the quest monster, Helium. Alright, so it's a light and fire attacker with tortures, extra turns, um, and skill mirror and evasion skills. Interesting. So you got a rank zero hard end to mean to sunburn at rank one. Status gets her applies a random torture at started battle at rank three. Not bad. I think um, I think he's quite all right. You know what I mean. And it looks like he could be maybe a light monster. Well, it actually says it right here. Light and fire. Light and fire. Oh, that's actually pretty good for the current meta, right? So against like Serpentex, against Cupid and stuff like that. Pierce monsters. You gotta watch out. So I guess that's uh that's pretty good. He's not gonna get one shot like all the other monsters um but anyways so um pretty interesting elements uh what i'm gonna do whoops so what i'll do is i'm gonna go ahead and take these two breedings real quick although actually i don't need both of them what am i doing i'm gonna go ahead and sell this one uh, i'm gonna make some you know some space for this mythic when we do obtain it let's go ahead and do that cool all right so Let's head over here, go to the breeding events. Alright, what do we got? The monster, right? So, uh, what are the relic slots? Mask and banner? Interesting. Alright, um, so I like the design, I've got to say. It's like a knight monster, basically, with wings. It's kind of cool. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and breed it. You can also breed Telolite and a few other monsters. So, it gives you quest key, quest scroll, and back school free chest. Alright, here we go guys. So Dark Soul with Water Magma. Those are the two monsters you need. Let's go on and start breeding. So 46 hours. Alright, so one day in 21 hours, obviously. It's either going to be a mythic, a legendary, or whatever. So it looks like one of the possible results could be this mythic monster right here, guys. So as you guys can see, Dark Soul with Water Magma. So, okay. I, I'm, I'm assuming it's all three of them, yeah. Okay. So we could be seeing, you know. These three monsters, possible results, or we could just get the mythic first try. What do you guys think? I think I'm probably gonna get like a Telolite on my first one. Watch. The Telolite mythic, I'm probably gonna get that. And so 9 hours and 11 minutes, let's go ahead and speed this up. I told you. Watch, the second one will be Sir Valgar. You ready? Sir Valgar it is. <laughs> no way. Alright, this... Third one is going to be, mm, I, I have to choose this wisely, it's going to be, um, I know some of you guys are like, it's going to be ours making, but no, it's actually going to be tall light, you guys ready? Tall light it is. No, no okay, I should have probably gone to Survivor. oh my gosh, that is so cool if I got all three of them right. <laughs> hey, but at least I got like two of them right in a row. Anyway, that's not good, what am I doing? Um, I'm trying to, I'm trying to go for the mythic, right? I'm trying to go for the new mythic, uh, give me the new mythic, please. This one's going to be the new mythic. Has to be. Watch. Bam. That's what I'm talking about. I got that one right. Yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, we got ourselves Helium. Yeah. Helium it is. I'm going to go ahead and do a review on that very soon. Seems like an interesting monster. So, um, there is gem discount, but there's no frat for this monster. So, you can't get the extra cells from your teammates, sadly. Um, but I'm going to continue repeating that, obviously. Um... Should we try one more time? Nah, I mean, I already got the monster. Why do I need to retry it, right? Right? Like, that's just gonna be a waste of gems. I know I have, like, 6,000 gems, but... It's just gonna be a waste. Anyways. Can I activate this? I can. Cool. I thought I already activated that, like, yesterday or something. I guess not. Maybe it was just a dream or something. I swear, I thought I remember um, activating that. So, what's it called? Um, I can actually collect all my gold now because the uh, team race is over. It's literally over, so... Let's see what we got here. Loading race. Come on, come on, come on. What do we got? The second team is kind of uh, catching up with us. You see that? 83 laps. They're kind of sneaking up to us. Now, here's the thing, guys. If you didn't know, for the position rewards, right? 
Um, second team gets 480 cells, first team gets 600 cells. So right now we're going to be getting 600 cells. But if Visitors of Doom actually sneaks up and skips us, it's gonna we're going to basically get uh, 480. That's what they're getting right now, the 480, but um, they could go for 600. But we're not going to let them, obviously. So anyways, uh, we will be getting a rank 4 Koi Boy. And I'm going to go ahead and rank that up from there on um, once the... What's it called? Once the... Um, once I obtain the monster and take it to dungeons, you know, I'm going to rank it up from there. But anyways, so what I do want to go over is Team Wars, guys. So here's the thing. The current Team Wars were up against Power of Fun. You guys may or may not know Power of Fun was literally the best team in the game a couple years back. They were number one for a while, you know, just like Team Spirit 2015. But later on, they kind of just stopped spending money because Mythic got released and then... You know, now they're basically up against us. Now, here's the thing, guys. You guys want to see something? Let me see if any of these guys... Okay, this player is actually running um, two legendaries and one mythic, I see. But what I'm going to be doing is running all three legendaries for this war. Look, Boosted is also running legendary monsters. Let's see. Bunky is currently running legendaries, but I'm sure she'll, she'll change that. Professor is also running it. Um, so there's going to be lots of legendary bases. As you guys can see, there's this player, a Coco, that's running um, uh, legendary monsters, more legendary monsters. So if you guys want to see me record a video uh, with uh, me using legendary monsters against these bases, because, you know, we kind of sorted this out with them, with Power of Fun. We created a chat and I was like, you know what, if you guys want to, you know, um, put on legendary monsters and have like a fun war with just legendaries, we can do it. And look at that, some of them... They already have legendaries up. Well, except the Silvira. That, that's a Doom monster. But what I'm going to do is once the war starts, I'm going to set up my base, obviously. And it's going to be a fun war with uh, just using legends, obviously. So here's uh, something that I'm going to be running. Uh, if I go to legendary... By the way, this is my only option anyway. So I ended up uh, equipping x for this war. But probably going to run something like this. You know what I mean? We got Warm Lad. We got St. Tyrion. We got Gracon. So double dot Jerry with Megatons. Uh, there is uh, a Pierce monster in this war as well, but um, I don't have a rank, so I'm not going to use it, and that's Wild Bird. So there's also a Resurrector like Ural, obviously, and there's also Worm Lad. But it's going to be a fun war, so we're going to see how it goes, but I can't wait. I seriously can't wait. It's going to be a super fun war. So let me know in the comments down below if you guys want to see a Team Wars video against the Power of Fun, where basically we use legendary monsters. Uh, for defense and possibly even offense as well so it's gonna, it's gonna be a fun war but anyways so with all that being said there is this uh, back to the challenge which uh, i already went over obviously i spent uh, over a thousand coins on it make sure you guys check out that video at the end of the race i will be opening up this chest right here let me show you guys real quick where is it um the back to school no the marathon blossom chest so we're gonna get a random blossom mythic monster i know you guys tend to enjoy those videos so I'm gonna go ahead and do that for you guys but anyways let me know in the comments down below if you guys actually got yourself um this new mythic monster i'm gonna do a review on it very soon so make sure you guys are subscribed to see that but the tales is also beginning i think tomorrow if i'm not mistaken so make sure you guys um have all those back to school tokens collected and stuff because look i have how much, how much do i have at the moment i have about 174 which should be enough to you know get some extra cells and stuff like that um but i honestly don't know how many um or what rank i'm actually gonna go for maybe i'm gonna go for a rank four and then spend my tokens and it's basically gonna be a rank five you know the six thousand cells and then on top of that finish it off with some more uh, with those tokens i could do that but we'll see i don't know yet what i'm gonna do but we're gonna have to just wait and see but yeah guys, that will be pretty much it for today's Monster Gens video. Hope you guys did enjoy and if you did, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.